Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, from the mozzarella room of the Cannelloni Hilton, high atop Sherwood Kirby, overlooking a mugging, just two miles from downtown Fresno, the provolone capital of the world. And now to help bring in the new year, here is our all-girl orchestra asking the musical question, Opus One. Staggering up to the microphone, direct from the three-month tour of his wine cellar, the baritone of the breweries, Mr. Blinky Tomlin. Now to the my affection can change my complexion from rose to whitey red. And the time she holds my hand, I tell me that she's mine. Oh, thank you. And now here's Miss Peggy Lynn. I remember when I was a little girl, I fell in love with the most wonderful boy in the world. I remember the first time he took me to his apartment. He kissed my hand, he kissed my shoulder, he kissed my face, he kissed me and kissed me again and again until finally I looked up into his eyes and I said, Is that all there is? Is that all there is? If that's all there is, from Hollywood. First, let me introduce my good friend, Cary Grant. Oh, Judy, 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 you gave me your arm, you gave me your lips, you gave me your soul, but the good stuff you kept for yourself. Judy, here's one of my closest friends, Mr. James Cagney. <laughs> Warden, I'm not going in that room, see? I'm not going in that room. What's that ladies' room? <laughs> Miss Scarlet, you dirty, lovely rat. <laughs> you're going to hear from Rhett Butler. Whether you like it or not, you're going to hear from Rhett Butler. Go ahead, Rhett. Yeah, I... Scarlet, you can stay with the South, but I'm joining the Union. I got this, Scarlet, because it pays 60 20 an hour. <laughs> you want to hold the glass, Scarlet? I'd like to have you meet Mr. Humphrey Bogart. <laughs> All right, Sam, play it again. Oh. One more time, Sam, play it again. You're gonna have to keep playing it, Sam, till you learn it, see? Exciting, isn't it? And the real biggie is yet to come. Right off the sound stage is over at Biograph. We invited, just for New Year's Eve, the world's greatest comedian, Mr. Charles Chaplin. Yeah. 